chase Liaki with the blue futon. And I went to the movies again to see Godzilla vs. Kong. What did I think about this movie? It's exactly what you expect, Godzilla vs. Kong, and maybe other monsters in there as well that connects to other past movies. People say the worst part about this are the human characters, but when you watch a movie about Godzilla vs. Kong, what else do you want from a movie? This is action-packed non-stop. I won't lie, the first part of the movie, part one, was a little bit slow, and I was like, okay, let's get to the action, but when the action came, it was non-stop. Absolutely gorgeous CGI, everything happening with, with a good thing. I'll say two flaws I've noticed with this movie. Uh, number one, why does Hong Kong always get hit hard? And with that, millions of people probably died. Millions of people probably died. But I just always wonder with all the Chinese cities out there, why is Hong Kong one always getting just beat up randomly? And then number two, it's going to be the fake news size where it says CNN in the very beginning. says only six people died from the first Apex. <laughs> six people died from that nuclear blast? CNN, you're such fake news. Anyway, I liked it. Did you? She sucked the Blue Futon. Like, comment, subscribe. One of the things, Bhutan Topia, you Blue Tonians. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Peace and love, peace and love. And yes, a little bit of chaotic house. I know.